Good day. My name is Mauro and I'd like to continue along our voyage or our trip through the various blends that Sandali has created. Today we will be speaking about the Stradivari blend. Stradivari is the pinnacle of our blends and like most of the other blends that we have created, we have given it the name of a musician. In this case, a violin maker. Now Stradivari is a blend that uh, we have created using 12 different origins. Uh, all Arabica coffees and uh, many of these, if not all of them, can be considered to be gourmet coffees. Now you might be asking yourself why use a blend? Well, there are certain elements that are very important to uh, bear in mind when using a blend or when using one of our blends. First of all, our blends give you a typical Italian taste. So you can roast these blends anywhere around the world, uh, giving your clients a typical Italian espresso blend taste, but freshly roasted in your own countries. Now, in the creation of our blends, we try and create a coffee which is very, very well balanced. So all the various elements of that coffee there, like acidity, like body, like sweetness, bitterness, etc., are on a par or are very well balanced. Okay, and here is the Stradivari. Uh, 12 components, I repeat. 12 components of different uh, Arabica coffees. As you can see, the color is uniform due to the excellent selection of these beans. And uh, uh, obviously over here you have various types of processing methods as well. So you have some washed, some natural, etc., etc. Uh, coffees. This type of selection obviously gives you a very nice, very good roast, very even roast, as you can see. Um, one would almost not suspect that this is made of 12 different coffees. Okay, so the cups are here, they're being freshly extracted. Let us go and smell them. Mmm, that's a very, very nice blend of cocoa and fruit coming out of there. Uh, the crema really is good. The crema is excellent. Considering that this is a 100% uh, Arabica blend, you have a thick crema, it holds the sugar well, um, it is a light golden brown color, and uh, definitely looks very inviting. But let's go taste the cups. Okay, first impressions. The uh, body is powerful. It is a powerful body, considering it is 100% Arabica. Uh, the acidity is, um, I'd say, a medium acidity here, uh, but the aftertaste is exceptional. It really is something to be reckoned with. Let's go on to the specifics. What to say? I mean, here you really do have, in the acidity, you have a whole uh, series of different aromas coming out. Um, these aromas change with time, and uh, they uh, range from fruit to citrus to floral to spiciness, and they continue for a very long period of time in the aftertaste. In the aftertaste, you definitely get a nutty, caramel, um, dark cocoa type of taste, but extremely pleasant, extremely noble, really a good cup of coffee. Um, where, to, where to use this coffee? Well, you have basically a, a whole series of different options. It is a very, very good all-rounder as far as, uh, as extractions are concerned. Everything from espresso, cappuccino, mocha, filter, pods, and capsules, the works.